Hey guys, Rob from MyPPCTraining.com and in today's video we are going to walk you through setting up and installing a Google AdWords conversion pixel. It's very important you have this set up. Without this setup, there is it's impossible to scale or track any conversions or leads or cost per leads or anything in an AdWords campaign. Alright, so let's dive right in. Okay, so you should be logged into your Google AdWords account and you should be under your campaign. If you're not, come down here, choose your campaign up out of your uh, account, and then you're going to see you should be on your home page here. So what we're going to do is really simple. All we're going to do is click the wrench here under measurement, conversions, and just pretend we don't have these here set up. Obviously, we already have conversion tracking set up. What you're going to do is hit this plus sign. You're going to choose website because we're setting up form submission leads in this tutorial and just name your conversion so we'll just say form subs and come down here to category and lead value you can put a value to the lead it's up to you for right now we're just not going to use one count we only want one we don't want multiple conversions for just one lead and then you're going to hit create and continue and this is very important guys this is where it's different than the old interface so it's important that you set this up correctly so this is the global site tag you're just basically gonna copy it and this is gonna go on every page of your website okay and then this code down here on that you're gonna have on page load this code is gonna go only on your thank you page okay and that's what's gonna track your conversions so every page of the website, only the thank you page. All right, so let's pop over to our Insta page where we have our thank you page set up. So right now we're inside our Insta page account and inside the thank you page that we will be using that's going to show after a form is submitted on our website. All right, so we've already went ahead and installed the global site tag on our main website. So this basically, if we're going to use the ClicksGeek website, so when someone wants to get pricing, they're, this is going to pop up, and they're going to go ahead and fill this out, hit submit, and be redirected to a thank you page. And we'll just say for, for time's sake, this is the thank you page. This is where the event snippet code needs to go. Okay, so remember, this code, global site tag, goes on the main website, that you're, or landing page, or wherever you're sending the traffic to on every page of the website and it tells you like directions up here on where to put it and stuff like that so we go between the head tags all right and this code goes only on the thank you page so basically you just copy that come over here into our insta page and if you guys aren't using landing pages for adwords i think you're nuts you should definitely set up an insta page account it's free i'll drop a link below in the video in the comment section and uh, you should be able to sign up for a 14-day trial or something like that or seven days or whatever it is. But you definitely should not be sending traffic to a home page of a website using AdWords. You're going to get crushed. And it's way easier to track everything with landing pages. So anyways, thank you, page. We're on it. We have our event snippet code. What we're going to do is very simple. We're going to come down here. We're going to go to HTML, CSS, head tag, paste. I didn't copy it, but yeah, you paste it in here. Come back, hit publish, and it's live on the site. And that's it. So now anytime AdWords traffic hits this page, it's going to fire the code as a conversion, and you're going to be able to track form submission leads. I mean, it's really that simple. That's it. So I'm hoping that you guys already have conversion tracking set up. If you're, if you're new to the new interface, then you definitely, you definitely need to get this set up and get with the program because the, new, the old interface is getting phased out in the next two months. So it's really important, and it's totally different. Because the old interface, they just give you one code, and then you just throw it on a thank you page. And that code, I don't know if Google's going to migrate it. I'm not sure what they're going to do yet, but you need to make sure that you have the site, the global site tag, and the event code, or event snippet. So drop some, uh, drop some questions in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think. If you uh, do something differently, I'd love, to, I'd love to hear about it. Or if you use a different landing page software, I'd love to hear about that too. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, like and share this video. And check out the uh, description links. We left some cool stuff in there for you.
All right, guys.